As a poor kid from the projects, Deion Sanders had used school sports to steer clear of drugs and crime. But now at the age of 18, as he graduated high school, he was facing new temptations. The Kansas City Royals were offering the quick road to riches, just as Florida State had offered Deion a free ride to college. He thought if they can offer him 75000 he could make even much more if he'd go to college. I believe in me like no other. If you don't believe in yourself, ain't nobody else will. And he said, Mom, I think I'm going on to school. 22 freshmen on the trip, Jane, and I think we've played 20 of them. Uh, of course, the game, when we got way ahead, you can do things like that. But uh, I thought that was real, real good. So, oh, boy, nice hit by Deion Sanders from uh, Fort Myers, Florida, freshman. And Clayton coming down the line on the option. Keeps it. He's loose. He's gone. In the galaxy of Florida State's freshman stars, he is the most luminous. The only rookie to start for these fourth-ranked Seminoles, Deion Sanders has been fired upon early, but so far he has put on a gold star performance. He knows being a freshman he's going to be tested. He's going to be picked on a little bit when he's there. And uh, so far he's, uh, you know, he's, he's made the play when he had to make it. Last year when I quarterback in high school, we had a weak spot out there on defense. I would throw to that spot, and they consider me the weak spot now. But in games to come, and you know, with them watching, I don't think I'll be a weak spot from now on. An all-purpose man by trade, Sanders also handles Florida State's punt returns. He's daring, exciting, and last weekend against Memphis State, he was a man with a mission. I wanted to score. I want to score bad. I mean, real bad, because my parents was at the game. And, I just really want to score and get in the end zone. With his early success as a freshman starter, folks already are comparing Deion Sanders with some of the all-time greats here at Florida State, including Bobby Butler. I don't want them to really compare me to him because if I make a mistake or something, old Bobby wouldn't have made that mistake when he's really not a Bobby Butler. I just want to go out there and be myself and make it on my own. Deion Sanders is not short on confidence or, as you've seen, ability. The only thing standing in his way is time. Scott Atwell, Channel 6 Eyewitness Sports at Florida State. The tight ends goes up. H-back goes in motion. Option play. Go back. First down. What a back. Oh, my. Richie Stevenson punted. Now watch freshman Deion Sanders work magic. He hauls it in at the 40 and breaks outside, appears to be gone. But Terry Robinson, his own man, slows him down a bunch. He still picked up 34 yards before Stevenson made the saving tackle. He should have saved himself the trouble. Including a huge one in the 1989. And offensively of South Carolina. Here's Mike Holdback, and he's going to throw, and that's a dangerous pass out there. The ball is caught out there by Sharp. Now they say he did not catch it, and that's a wise thing to do. They're working on him. Incomplete. Hunter from Orange Park, Florida, a senior, as he kicks it off and gets off a high one. Deion Sanders takes it at the 33, the 35, the 40, at the 45, cuts out at the 50-yard line. He's across the 40-yard line, inside the 35, and still on his feet, and they get him at the 33-yard line. Deion Sanders, he was drafted to play baseball. He can stuff a basketball in the rim anytime he wants to, and he's got great football ability. Look at him in the open field, putting a little wrinkle on right there. Just a tremendous natural athlete. I saw this young man play in the Florida Georgia High School All-Star game. And he gets a nice one off. It's going to be taken down by Sanders at the 42. He's at the 45. He's across the midfield stripe. That's back at the 40. And he's got some room. And he's at the 20. He's at the 15, the 10, the 5. And he's in the end zone for the score. But there is a flag on the play at the 15. Just tremendous athletic ability by Deion Sanders. I don't think anyone ever got more than an arm on him. That's the lift the Knolls were looking for. Illegal procedure against the Gators is declined. The Knolls have a big, big play by Deion Sanders, the freshman from North Fort Myers, Florida. Watch the cutback right here. Now he's in a wall of Seminole blockers. Cuts back again. Lewis Oliver missing on the tackle. Now Criswell is the last player there, and he doesn't have a chance. Williams. Going over the middle and into traffic and incomplete. No. 
from the 20. Ronnie Williams throws, and it's incomplete. Up at the Deion Sanders and the ball, both getting to Terry Weimer simultaneously. I think when Ronnie Williams looks at the film here, he'll see that he threw the ball into traffic. Actually, By the end of his first year, he was making a name for himself in three sports, football, baseball, and sometimes track. Our track coach asked him, will you run in one of our meets? Oh, yeah, I'll run in one of your meets. So he goes over and runs in the meet and whips world-class sprinters. <laughs> Play. Second down and 10. Quick out, Bergen. Looking and broken up. Pull back who is injured and will not see action this evening. Second down, seven yards to go. Bergen's got all day to throw. He's got a man. It's Farmer down inside the 30, 29 yard line. Finally, he finds the back on the sideline, turns it upfield. Very fortunate Deion Sanders was there with his feet in order to cut him off, or it might have been six. For a drawing to win that rug at halftime of the Florida Florida State football game. Bergen drops it out in the flat to Hutchinson, and Hutchinson receives it for, well, about two or three yards. That's really about it. Return department. The Alabama-Ohio State game uh, this past Thursday night was any indication it's going to work. Taken by one of the up men, this is Brian Jones. Capable quarterback. He and Bergen are both roommates and a very, very good friends, very close friends. What the hell are you doing? Sager drops Pat, fires it across. Great play by Sanders. Sanders just knocked it out of the hands of Hutchinson. If Hutchinson had gotten around you, that could have gone a long way. You know, we talked about Tim Ingles and all his talent. Here's a guy, number two, Deion Sanders, that's got more talent than anybody on that field. Lewis Berry and Derek Schmidt, Florida State has one of the best kicking games in college football. And the defense has showed tonight through three quarters that it's ready to play in 86. Deion Sanders on a big punt return for the Seminoles. Grimm gets pretty good punt off this time, and Sanders will take it at his sideline. Oh, what a block. And Sanders has got all kinds of running room. Sanders all the way across the field, down to the 41-yard line. And in motion comes Vaughn Shepard, and Taylor's looking for the pass. Gets it off. Pass is caught by Stitzler. Uh, Jason Gamble it is. Jason Gamble had come in at the wide receiver spot, split in. He may have fumbled. He did. Florida State's got it. So on the hit, Stitzel, uh, Gamble lost him. Jones looked like he wanted a blitz, but the long count got him outside Jones. Jones hit behind the line of scrimmage by Deion Sanders, number two. A fiery sophomore out of Fort Myers, Florida. Another outstanding athlete for the Seminoles. Looks to throw it. Gets it off to the sideline. Rob Schnitzler is over there, caught it out of bounds. He takes that little roll to the left and puts the ball right on the money. Now, here he comes. You only need one foot in. There it is. Didn't have control. Did not have control was the key to the play as well. Huskers have it. And Steve Taylor goes down the line with it. Keeps it. And moves it up to the 44 for five yards. Cut down by Deion Sanders. Remember that name. Deion Sanders, six feet, 180, a sophomore out of Fort Myers. You'll hear that a lot in years to come, I expect. Benson goes in motion for Nebraska. Taylor coming on the option, keeps it. And 13, Carolina. Here comes the blitz. And Paul is going to get away. His mobility helps him. It's picked off. That's Deion Sanders. What a broken field runner he is to the 40-yard line. Florida State football. And the tackle was made by Jonathan Hall, the quarterback. One of the things that Mickey Andrews was stressing with his charges was turnovers. You see Fred Jones chases Hall out of the pocket, desperately trying to get to him. Hall tries to get it up over the top of Deion Sanders, but Sanders goes up and makes the great catch, and he's probably the best athlete on the field, Deion Sanders. Look at him move now. And you saw him step out of bounds at the point of the reception, so they spot it at the 48 and a half. Carolina is doing on defense. Hall, plenty of time, has a man open. However, it's picked off by Sanders. Tackled at the 19, 18-yard line. Intended for 32, Eric Lewis. Number two, Deion Sanders. His second interception of this football game. This man's only a sophomore. He'll be an All-American. Second down is going to air it out. In the past against Kansas and in previous uh, 
games this year against the Citadel, they had a tendency to go to the backs. And what they tried to do is catch Florida State in some kind of blitz, some kind of man-to-man -man coverage. But Sanders Florida seems to be ever zone. alert. Special teams for Florida State. Now the free kick from the 20-yard line. Not it's a good one. No, it's taken by Sanders at the 30, at the 40, at the 50, at the 42-yard line of North Carolina. And the hometown crowd of the Seminoles comes to life here. All 10 of them coming after that punt. Nobody gets there. Sanders at the 26. And the first carry is a fake and a long toss for Colasar incomplete. Looking downfield for John Colasar, well covered by Deion Sanders. Right in the middle, a squeegee board. They had him squeezed in the middle. Martin Mayhew along with Deion Sanders. 57 to go. Harbaugh handing off to Jamie Morris. And Morris has a first down. Look at that little. Harbaugh marks out the signal. Back to throw on first down. Has plenty of protection. Now goes the other way. Now the protection is still good. Harbaugh directing traffic. He's going to have to run the ball out of bounds. For the Heisman Trophy favorite. Hits Irvin that time. The same pattern on the far sideline. And Sanders, number two, was the defensive back who took him out of bounds. Fiegels booms a punt to Sanders. Fields it at the 30. That's Looking for an alley. The kicking game gives the Seminoles field position inside the 40-yard line. Fullington brought him down, and Fullington might have saved a touchdown. That was a 44-yard punt with a 30-yard return by Sanders. Well, Bobby Bowden says Deion Sanders is the best athlete on the football team. He's got the speed. He could be a wide receiver or running back, and certainly demonstrates that. On Look at him make the moves in here. Picks the daylight perfectly. Comes to the wall. Gets the corner turn. Watch him make this little move here. Try to fake out the defender. Look at this. At the ball like a loaf of bread. I thought he was going to pass it. Left hand. <laughs> He's back to work. Time. Going for Urban. Beautiful interception oh, by Sanders. Sanders. Coming back. Hayes inside the 20-yard line. What a catch he made. No wonder Bobby was thinking about switching him over to receiver earlier this year. Irwin had him beat. Absolutely had him beat. I could see it from up here. Sanders made a tremendous recovery. Came over the shoulder. You'll see a pump fake right there, and he beat him. Now Testaverde will put it up, and it looked like he had it. Watch Sanders come over the top, make the interception. What a great defensive play. Here's the view from the ground level. Look at him go up and pick that ball off. That is a sensational play. Era, I think Florida State. A low snap. Eagles comes up and does get it off quickly. Good job by the punter in that situation. Sanders returning. Slips free. Great return to the 45. What a good-looking athlete he is. The Seminoles will come out right there. A 34-yard punt on CBS. Sarah? Look at these moves by Deion Sanders. Bobby Bowden said he is. He can play any position for him. And he's been sensational as a punt returner this afternoon as well as a cornerback. Self-nicknamed Primetime. His career at Florida State. James Massey, and Massey is stacked up as he crosses the 15-yard line, gets to about the 17-yard line before Paul McGowan, the weak side linebacker, junior from Winter Park, makes the hit. Warren Jones, McGowan, Hayes back up the line for FSU defensively. And meanwhile, it is Sanders, Shiver, Newell, and Eric. And Kerwin Bell looks to throw. And he throws, going for Mulberry, intercepted by Dion Sanders. And he takes him down at the 20-yard line. Ricky Natil takes him down right at the... He's a tremendous athlete. I saw him play in a high school all-star game between the states of Florida and Georgia, and he was fantastic. Kerwin gets plenty of protection, tries to sneak the football down the sideline on a fly route to Ricky Natil, but Dion Sanders had none of it. First and ten for the Knowles at the slot offense to the left side. Kerwin Bell to give off to Massey. Massey fights and he gets up to the two-yard line. Scribe and it's carried over to their defensive unit. Out in the flat to Ricky Natale. And Natale is taken out of bounds. Or rather, Stacey Simmons gets. Deion Sanders applies the finishing touch for the 27-13 victory over Scrappy Indiana. 
Dion drove around campus in his new Chrysler convertible with personalized primetime license plates, talking on his cell phone, all courtesy of his hardworking mother, Connie. He said, Mom, he said, cornerbacks isn't making any money. He said, I got to do something to make plenty of money. Because he always used to always say, a closed mouth is never fed. And he just created a monster. First pass incomplete. Blades with a hand on it and Dion Sanders numbered. They'll run out of it. They sweep Bratton. He cannot get the corner. Dion Sanders, the All-American corner, was there to hold him down, and they exchange pleasantries there at the sideline. Yeah, these Florida State defense can run as well as the Miami team. They forward, they bounce it, the ball outside. That was supposed to go off tackle, but it gets bounced outside and pushed to number two, Sanders. You're not going to outrun him. Bratton's a pretty big back, but it's a good job of tackling there by Sanders. Goes high on him. Front. Gets it off high to Sanders. A superb punt returner at the 35. Beautiful return by Deion Sanders. A 10-man front. Deion trying to whip up the crowd. Now Sanders is a superb punt returner. He's got a clear path. Tremendous run by Deion Sanders. Inside the 45-yard line. As good a punt return as you'll ever see. 33 yards. Notice how patient he was as he brought the ball back. The key to this, though, although Deion Sanders does a nice job of running the ball here, was how, how many defenders the Florida State rushman held up. There was nobody. He had about two or three seconds before any white jersey showed up. He held up the coverage team incredibly well. And he did a lot in his own. Or another great coaching move by Bowden staff. When his final college football season began, Dion became the team captain, leader, and mentor. I have power among Berger calmly steps to the right. Wanted Tillman, and Sanders was there all over him. Players early so that you're strong in the fourth quarter. Low line drive, it's returnable. It's Sanders. Battles his way. Comes free. Out to the 41-yard line. He's one of the best in college football. It's far off to the right-hand side. That's why the official ruled it. Now here they run Mose, and he is stopped short of the first down. Thanks. Are you listening, Mr. Dye? Off a of play fake. Berger is back. Going long diving attempt there by lawyer Tillman who has been shut down pretty effectively. Down the sideline for Tillman. And Sanders stayed with it. I seen him catch balls like that. Well, that's another uh, terrific play by Deion Sanders. You know, he's you have different philosophies when you have a guy like him. You either put your best man on him and go after him like they're doing here, or you stay away from him. Today, Auburn's tried to pick on him with Tillman. And Generally, Sanders has got the better of the battle. Sanders was a high school quarterback out of the Fort Myers area. Through left-handed. Do a good punt. They should be able to cover that. Sanders with a fair catch. And a tackle made after the fair catch signal. I'll tell you, oh, I think, boy. I don't think it was a very good signal. Maybe we'll see on a replay that... Watch his left arm now. Let's Dick. see what kind of a job he does. Yeah, he does it. That's good enough. That's all he needs. He, that's good enough. Massey didn't see it. Personal foul. Dead ball against the kickers. Pitch out. Emmett Smith. Anthony Williams in front. Good block. Big hole. He's got and it. It's off to the races. One man to beat. The one is Deion Sanders who hauls him down. in for 29 yards. That one is complete. You can see he can snap it off face mask. You bet it is. Deion Sanders got caught, the All-American cornerback. Of a 15-yard face mask against the defense. Deion Sanders. 
been named to all the All-American teams announced thus far. Yeah, Dion comes in, wraps him up there, and he, his left hand comes around, and he gets him by the fast face mask right there. See, he's got a real good grip on it right across the face. Deep left side, yep. overthrown incomplete, intended for Ed Frazier. Boy, is that a long throw from the college hash marks. Officially the 19-yard line. Here's Taylor on the option. The pitch is to Jones. He loses it, but out of bounds. He had last possession. As you see, Deion Sanders, the cornerback, the All-America who made the play, as you can, he's really keyed up. He's Charlie, ready. He really is, Charlie. The key to Steve Taylor, they can't let him control the football. They want to make him pitch it every time, and they do there, forced him into the bad pitch. Deion Sanders makes the right move. He goes after the player, hoping someone else would. Turn it over twice. Bubble recovery and an interception, and here's Keith Jones. Defense brings him out, and he'll pick up four to the 40-yard line. You look for the throw here. There's pressure. Here it is. Could be intercepted, and it is at the 40-yard line by Deion Sanders. Should have eaten the football or thrown it away. He's throwing into the area, and Deion Sanders, maybe the best defensive back in college football today, didn't have to work very hard on that, playing his own, able to step in front and make the interception. <laughs> and he, their own 27-yard line. Taylor to the outside. If he gets a yard... He's a very lonely man over on that yeah. corner because they, they simply want to throw to the other side. He's that good of a man-to-man -man coverage back. Four-yard line. It's there, Tim. Had a man in between, and he tried... Oh, and ever so close to them being intercepted. And they're going after Deion Sanders, and he makes the play. Right, they try to fit it in between Deion Sanders, number two, the cornerback, and Leroy Butler, number six, the safety. See, he turns him loose. He, Sanders turns him loose to the second man, but he's got such incredible makeup speed, he's able to come back and knock that ball away. That's not his play. That's the play of Leroy Butler, number six. But Sanders has the best makeup speed of any defensive back I have seen playing in college football today. His third year at Florida State, he became a college football All-American. The previous spring, he'd led Florida State's baseball team into the College World Series. Professional scouts took notice. Only a junior in college, the New York Yankees paid Dion $75,000 to play three months of minor league baseball. Drive it out of here. It does not, however. There will be a return for the Canes. And Hill trying to swing outside. He will not get to the 20-yard line as Deion Sanders, their great cornerback, came up and got him out of bounds. Draft choice. Terrific all-around running back. Hope he can come back. Walsh almost intercepted that time. Sanders stepped in. Far rolling. And throwing under pressure, and it's intercepted. Deion, he may score out away. It is Sanders for the touchdown. Here's your replay. Sprint action, Favre trying to get his shoulders upfield. He gets pressure, has to fall back, overthrows. There's Sanders. He's going to pick up a picket line, and I'll tell you, gang, offensive lineman ain't going to catch the 100-meter <laughs> Metro champion. Not at all. Keith Carter, the linebacker, applying the pressure and tiptoeing into the end zone. He is down to Williams left. They throw to Cooper, and Cooper is free at midfield. Deion Sanders, the fastest man on the field, comes over. And I'll never forget it. He goes out and he looks over to the Clemson bench and says, I'm bringing this one back. Here to block a punt. However, it's a one-step punter, and Chris Gardaki has gotten it off. The young man from Stone Mountain, Georgia. We're going to hear a lot from him. He'll be a field goal kicker as well as a punter here. He walks it, and now it'll be Deion Sanders from the 24. In the middle, twists his way, finds an alley. Now it's just the punter, he'll outrun it. It's going to be a touchdown, Florida State, Deion Sanders. There are no penalty markers down. An electrifying 76-yard run. Andrews with an attempt to tie. Did you 
just see that speed as the extra point is beautiful. I want you to watch this at normal speed. He comes into the middle. Just a little bit of a crack, a seam, he kind of slides through, and then he explodes. We're talking about 4-2-1, world-class speed. That was the timing by the Pro Scouts last spring. What a run by Sanders. We'll be right back. Third and long, complete, but short of a first down. Two great young defensive backs, Deion Sanders of Florida State. Starting to step up and assume a leadership role. Donnell Wolford of Clemson watching now from the bench over there. But the one thing that Bowden has needed with that defensive unit is leadership on the field. I talked to Bobby this week, and that's exactly what Deion on stepped to the forefront to do, to lead this defensive team. Butlin will kick it to Deion Sanders, and watch Sanders. What a threat he is. He's already returned one for a touchdown this year. He's returned an interception for a touchdown. He plays major pro professional baseball in the Yankees farm system. Butlin from the 15 gets pretty good wood on that one as Sanders takes it at the 15. Watch the show. To the 40-yard line. 89, Carlos Marino finally tackles him. 43 yards on the punt, 45 on the return. He's side on first and 10. McAllister's going for him. He's got him. Intercepted. Intercepted. Deion Sanders comes up with a major league interception. Now watch it, folks. Lee, he's already signed a pro baseball contract. He's got to have to make a decision because he's going to be one of the top five picks in the NFL draft this year. I wish I was his agent. Watch this one. Now, I think, you know what I think? He baits McAllister into throwing the ball. Look, he's just gliding. He's waiting for the ball. He goes up and intercepts it. That is an absolutely perfect play. You could go to a clinic and not show a better play than that over and over. Watch the athletic ability to be able to control his body and catch the football. Oh, he's a tremendous athlete. And he doesn't get it. Nearly blocked and might have gotten a piece of it. And Sanders will take it at the 11. Look at this quickness. Look at this quickness. To the 30-yard line, Deion Sanders. Can Deion Sanders. He will not dress tonight. Not dressed. In fact, he's down on the sidelines playing with the ball, throwing it up like he'd be catching it for a punt. <laughs> He did injure that knee, and I tell you, he's going to be missed, Paul, because he brings to the defense an offensive mindset. He's able, to, from his cornerback position, and especially his yep. punt returns, to bring on an offensive or a, or, a, or a type of excitement to that defensive side of the ball that's very hard to replace. Operates the option and fires. Open. The slot back. the 49. Two men to the right. Ellis looking that way and gambling. Deion Sanders almost took that one back for six. I want you to watch number two. They say he has tremendous closing speed. He'll play off, but he'll come up fast. Watch how quick this guy runs. Look at that. If that ball was on the mark, it might have been intercepted. Now, I'm surprised. It's man coverage. They go right after everybody's All-American Deion Sanders. That's confidence in Ellis, but I don't know if it's wise. Maybe the last time you see that pass tonight. John and John, home first and ten as Fury looks to throw. Chased and Frank and deep. And Deion had a shot at it and couldn't get there. Nick Cullen, the flanker, all the way down at the Seminole 15, was the intended receiver. That would have been for Deion Sanders, his 14th career interception, his fifth of this season. Well, Deion hadn't seen this in a while. This ball is about 72 yards in the air. Whew. Fire on him. For here's Bausha. The low line drive, and Sanders, like a jet across midfield. To the 40. Still on his feet. 35. 30 yard line. A 
29-yard punt erased by a 28-yard return. This is why they call him primetime. Watch how many people get a hand on him. One, two, three, not down yet. There's a fourth one, a fifth one. Nobody's grabbed him. Not till number six does he go down 28 yards later. Bobby Martin for Tech on the stop. From the 32. Pure fluff. Throwing deep. Intercepted Sanders. He out at the 30. For the 25. Flushed out by Hayes. Throws across his body. Sanders there to step in front of it. And if not for a lone offensive lineman just kind of stepping in his way there, Sanders might have been able to go the distance. A 40-yard return, and the left tackle, Skip Pavlik, made the stop. Well, Dion is having a big first half, and you see there he is tied, Lee Corso, and just one behind the old time. The Seminoles show a 10-man rush. Flag down. Bausher gets it away. Dion already at the 40. Spinning to the 34. I think you take the return, but if you're Deion Sanders, you probably are over there in Coach Bowden's left ear saying, let me have it again. Jack, is this your first uh, opportunity to watch the great Deion Sanders? Uh, no, I, I, I've seen a couple of games uh, before, and every time he's been exciting, and tonight certainly has been again. He's outstanding. Well, he's already said, Deion Sanders, he wants four years, $4.5 because he's a defensive back, a punt returner, and an entertainer. Deion Sanders is already a professional baseball player. What do you think about that, Lee? Being yeah. a pro in, in one sport and playing college football or basketball? Or I think it's a great idea. Since it happens very, very few times, I think it's a great idea. A guy like Sanders is a tremendous baseball player, goes and plays in the summer, comes back and plays football. That's not bad. And he's getting paid to play baseball, while the rest of the guys that he's playing football with are on scholarship. And Holding on the receiving team. Loose ball foul, be penalized. Going back to Sanders in that situation, remember, that could be probably one of the best summer jobs a man's ever had oh, in the history of football. Was it $70,000 summer job? Yeah, for six weeks. Bobby Bowden, he says, it's the first time I can say that I got a player that's got a car that I'd like to have. <laughs> Florida here in Tallahassee since 1980. Looks like they're going to end that particular hex as Deion Sanders takes it. Still going, still going to midfield, crawling forward. <laughs> he wants to go all the way every time he touches the football. When they came to me with, with problems or with the drama in their life, when they needed some money, I kept $5,000 on them at all times. The little bank roll and I always broke them off. And I worked my butt off and I was very successful. Deion's success became the Seminole success. He won the Jim Thorpe Award as the nation's best cornerback and led Florida State into the Sugar Bowl on the final play. Third and ten from the 22. Slack picked off by prime time. What timing. Neon Dion with his name up in lights. Sanders walks all the way over by the Auburn bench to do a little jawing. And Lawyer Tillman just a little late taking a break on the football. Deion Sanders looked more like the receiver than Lawyer Tillman. Really a pretty good throw. And Tillman doesn't come back to the football. And it's 10.55 Eastern, so still five minutes left in prime time. Sanders with the sixth interception of the year. Great athlete, great sprinter. We talked about the running back before. His style and his flash is what helped start drawing other talented players to Florida State.
watching him do his thing and the magic that he showed, that was something that I think helped Florida State become the power that it was. And electrifying 76.